Okay, I'm going in on um, warm up session. So you'll see how I kind of warm up, and I usually aim for like a 50 50 mark, you know. Um, so I'm going to join this arena thing here, it's uh, under 2000 arena. We're daring to go in on the arenas because obviously they do get a bit strange if they do lose. But not expecting to win anything here, just uh, this is, I'm going in as the warm up and just see how we get on. So we might play a lot of games or we might play a few games. This session looks like it's only got 24 minutes left so we'll potentially jump in on something else or we'll just do a general seek, whichever whichever way it works out. So this is a 10 minute zero rapid arena. So we'll just push in here. All right, so we'll just crack on and see how we get on. So it's 10 minutes with zero increment. So I don't need to move too fast. Just try and practice the stuff we've been training on. So bishop attacking the king, taking the knight off the board, keep it real simple. And castle, king safety. And look for any complications that the opponent's trying to put into the game. I mean, we could take the rougher in this pawn because he's got these linked pawns here. Could push our pawn uh, just to be a bit annoying. Um, which one do we want to go with? We could bring the bishop out because the pawn is protected. Do you know, what? I'm actually just going to bring the bishop out because the pawn is protected. If they're just pushing past, then oh, it's doubly protecting the pawn but also attacking the pawn here. So I might as well push this pawn up. So if the pawn does take, the queen and the knight are still on the pawn. Like we said, it's a warm-up session. If we make mistakes, we make mistakes. You live and learn. It's attacking the rook, so we'll just bring the rook here. So that's not too bad, I suppose. Knight could think about jumping here, jumping here, but it is kind of stuck on the rim. Um, I'm going to develop the knight and go with that. Can't see anything else at the moment. Is this knight looking to sink in here? So we're potentially looking to attack the king, attacking the pawn, the bishop is protecting as well. So it's moved the queen out of the way, attacking the um, knight. He's still on our pawn, so if we brought our bishop here x-raying through, then we only have one piece protecting the pawn, and the pawn can take. So it's an interesting situation. We could bring the queen up, elevate the queen, x-ray through to their queen. I think we'll do that. At some point he's got to be looking to take really, I think. Don't want to use all his energies. Probably looking to castle as well, but maybe not to there. Yeah, he's taking at some point. Shall we go for the exchange? See if they're going to exchange. Keep it simple. It is hard work, like I said, these sides they're strong players. And um, we're going to take right probably here, but uh, there's nothing really meaty with this position, just feels like a knee jerk reaction to go there to feel good. So it's x raying through to our rook, so potentially gonna have to bring the bishop back. I think we're probably losing tempo. Knight's gonna be coming here. Knight's going to jump down, it's got two pieces on there, but I suppose we can take, but then it's bishop take, but then we can take the bishop. Okay, let's go with that. They haven't got castled at the moment, but they might be one of those players that doesn't care about castling, causing problems for the players. Like I said, I think they've, oh, they've gone for it as well, so we can take. If they're looking at getting the bishop, the knight can boom around, around and actually capture. But they may just take here, but then we can take the bishop, the bishop. So it's quite nice that we did cover off that that's what they're potentially were going to do. Yep, so the knight can boom around around again. So we've got a minor piece up out of that situation. That's really quite interesting. Um, like I say, this knee-jerk reaction to jump the knight here, it's got nothing other than putting a check on the king over here. And I need to just take it out of my brain. We could attack the pawn here. Just conscious that the knights are actually on the same file. So they'll probably get hurt a bit. So I think I'm going to move this knight out of the way first. 
So I've got to think defensively now. This knight is protecting this pawn. If I just bring this rook here and just block any attempts, they may look to double up. So they're moving quick now. So if we can get the knight up in here, maybe looking to cause some trouble somewhere along here. We've always been chomping at the bit to go to this square, but oh, they look like they're moving a bit quick now. What's happening? Okay, so he's looking to double up. We couldn't, we can trade down, can't we? Because we've got more pieces. So if we go and challenge the rook, oh, he's just going to double up. So he's going to double up with his rook here. But I don't know. So they've moved back. Is it? Is there a fork anywhere? Um, knight here. I'm still chomping at the bit for this. We can actually go here because the knight is protecting the knight. Oh, push. Pawn takes. Pawn takes. Yeah, let's see if we push here. If they take. We can take with the knight. Don't think the bishop's going to want to take, but our rook doesn't have any support on. So it's going to be touching onto here. Push the knight here. Bring the knight around, attacking the bishop. Does that seem like some sort of plan? Doubles up his rooks though. That's the thing. He's going to double the rooks. What's my rook doing in the centre of the board? And mm, shouldn't be there really. <laughs> So maybe we push the pawn, supported by the rooks. Oh. We move, he pushes down onto our knight. Keep the pawn. Yeah, that's a, that's a nasty one, because then we'll lose the knight, won't we? So if we went this way, let's go this way with the knight. And go, try and follow that plan of doing this. So he's doubled the rooks. Is there something? There is that, but his rooks there. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So he's not going to take, but he could take this pawn. So if we approach this rook, no, we don't. If we go there, no. If we come all the way back down, got plenty of time, five minutes, got to find the right manoeuvre. No, none of, none of that, none of that, none of that. If we attack the bishop, we're also defending the pawn. The bishop then moves at our pieces, or just moves somewhere here. I think we're going to go with that, let's go with that. So that was the original move all along anyway. There's going to be little touches here and stuff disturbing the room. Alright, so now we can push. I suppose he pushes down onto our rook. Let's push. No, he's hitting the knight. Didn't put any thought into that either, did he? Damn, have I trapped myself? I trapped myself if I bring the knight here. It takes, knight takes, or the rook takes. It's hitting the rook. Can't go here because his bishop's on, so it gives us an excuse to come here and maybe double. Gonna be on a white square, got to be careful. Okay, let's go here. So the fighting back strong, so I'm not really feeling like I'm getting much benefit at the moment. Smaller pieces attacking higher pieces, um, they're doing everything right. Let's um, attack this pawn here. Bishop takes, we can. Ooh, supporting. Yeah, he's doing everything right. Move the knight across. Try and get here, but they're probably going to block that. Can take this pawn if they do push down. So if we get to oh, excuse me, if we get to here, we've got this type of situation attacking a piece, getting something off the board. But I think that they're kind of 
a little bit crafty. Oh, they've moved it out of the way anyway. Okay, so let's continue with this movement. Still got the fork type position. Just to push the pawn down. Try to get a reduction somehow because they look like they know what they're doing. They're finding the appropriate positions. I know how to block stuff off. We've got highly elevated pawns, so they're giving us something to think about. They're giving us a problem. I want to try and find the answers. Let's move the bishop out of the way. It doesn't like the fork idea. So if we continue with the fork, right? Let's see what happens. Rook comes down, maybe an attacks. Then we come here attacking. Giving them something to think about, maybe trying to make, ooh, try to improve the position. Knight across, no, nope. knight across, attacking again. Just make sure I've got a safe place to jump. I'm supported by the pawn anyway. It's just got everything covered off because we start pushing here. The bishop's there, defending that area. Time's running out. I think they're hoping that we run out of time. Ooh, come on, come on. This must be the one. Attack the rook. Oh, there must be a fork. Come on, come on. We push a little bit. Push a little bit, make space for the rook to come up. Let's just um, push here, supporting the knight. He's not wearing any of that, is he? Let's um, get this knight here. Maybe we can get the fork on the rooks. Come on, if there's a chess god somewhere, let me get this position. They're a little bit... Oh, he's actually going to push onto our rook. I'm going to take on his... Oh, are you joking? Oh, I missed that, didn't I? Oh, I missed that. Oh, that's shabby. Oh. Oh, down the power of the pieces. Oh, I missed that. Stealth bishop. Oh, for crying out loud. That's going to hurt. That's going to hurt. So what's he doing? So if we take his rook, then he pushes down with his pawn. And then we go here. Then he's got a checkmate ante because his rook comes down with a check on us. So if we move the king across, then he gets, he gets away. Oh, damn. Gutted. Take. Pushes. Bring the king rook across. No, nope, he just brings his rook down. We take, queen takes, check. <gasps> Mate. Oh, savage. Knight down, attacking the rook. Pushes onto our rook anyway. Take his rook. Yeah, I think that's probably the only thing, but it's not even going to help, is it? Because his rook's just going to come here and double up. Oh, sad times. Here, rook comes there. We take, his pawn takes. Oh, I'm disgusted. I'm disgusted with that. There's no increment either. Oh, shabby times. What the days is going on now? Taking stuff off all over the place. That didn't work out the way it was supposed to, was it? They're plus one because they've got. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Gonna have to do some bullet now. Oh, we're doing so well. We messed up the order. Damn stealth bishop. What's he doing? It's coming from a rook. Oh, 
Ooh, this is gonna hurt. This is not good. Oh, I've lost. Damn, it's gone. Unbelievable. Doing so well as well. These warm up matches. Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. Bum, bum. You know the rook's taking? Oh, unbelievable. You get games like this though, don't you? You know, absolutely. Oh. What does he think he's doing? Check. Do -do -do -do. And there's only eight minutes left of this arena. <laughs> we'll have to go in and just do some seeks. Um, okay, thank you. Is that a still, mate? <laughs> it's a still. Right, well, there's no more time left on this arena. This has only got five minutes, so we'll go in and do some general seeks now. You'll have to just bear with me while I'm flicking through my screens and stuff like that. And what are we going for? A uh, five minute game? Maybe a three minute game? Let's go for a three minute game. I need to move my head a little bit. Uh, like that. Yes, okay. Well, they're going for Fianchetto or stuff. Let's uh, develop the night. So, I've got to get back into speedy mode again, don't I? Let's go here. So, it's white square, isn't it? Let's go here. White square bishop, sorry. Let's just block that off. So, trying to block off that diagonal that they've got with the Fianchetto. Then look for an x ray through to their queen. But we'll just push this pawn first. x ray through to the queen. Important movement. Let's hit this pawn if they decide, but no, he's just going to take the bishop off the board. So he's capturing now, so his queen's going to feel good that he's actually winning because he's got an extra pawn. And um, we'll just go here. Alright, that's pretty swift, that's pretty swift, but um, does it improve their position? Let's go here. I think I've not caught, let's get this queen. Not caught up with the speed element, because we've just played a 10 minute game, so let's just go here. So I'm still catching up with how he's just trading down now. And uh, let's attack the bishop. 
let's kind of improve a little bit. Let's push here, support, and let's move the bishop out of the pawn out of the way because the bishop's just going to take. Dark square bishop's a bit bad at the minute, and simple trade down is going to win our rook and get a back rank checkmate. Oh, it would be nice if we could get that diagonal, but we can't. Let's see if we can get some ownership of this file. White square bishop is coming down to do something. Let's go here. And da -da. Let's get the bishop up here. Let's take this pawn. Let's go for this pawn. Yes, they're a bit flash, aren't they, with the speed? It's coming down for a checker meter. Let's go here. A bit flash with the speed. Let's go here. Check on where are you going, fella. Where are you going? Let's say to who? Maybe not that one. Let's go here. It's blocking off any attempts that we have of glory. Let's go here. Let's attack. So this one's not going too well because we had a little bit of a bad start catching up with the speed element. I might resign this one or I might just... Uh, oh, I can't actually take it. <laughs> I can't actually take it. <laughs> He's got the check on. Okay, let's resign that one. Let's bring the bishop out. So as we said, these are just the warm-up type matches that I do before I actually go in and play proper, but I thought I'll do, do an unfiltered version. Show the practice. Shall we? I've got the pawn here, defending against this pawn. Okay, nice and steady, just pace. Let's attack the bishop. Got two pieces defending the pot. Ew, what's he doing? Let's attack the bishop. It's getting on my nerves. Let's go. Let's take. Shall we push? No, maybe not today. Shall we just get the knight back again? Move the queen off of the x-ray. Potential for attacking the queen. So that's an interesting situation. We take his knight a, so it's there. Let's get the bishop off the board. Let's attack the knight because it's got no protection currently. But we have put ourselves in front of the rook. So then potentially looking to see if they're going to exchange once he decides that this pawn is coming to protect him. Yep. So let's go for the exchange. Don't think they're going to exchange, but just in case, let's do a preemptive. Oh, what's the rook in the game? Rook in the center of the board with a free pawn. Obviously coming to attack, so now we can go for a defense, or we can bring the knight around. Is there anything else? Knight, knight, knight. I think we're just going to, although he can just bring his rook up there, can't he? So I think I'm going to go here with the rook knight, sorry. Then he's going to double up. Yep, thought he would do that. So our knight is coming here. This pawn's coming down. It's not actually doing that yet. 
So let's push this pawn up. Knight wants to sink in here. Get this rook here. Yep, yeah, okay, let's uh, get the rook here. And get the king across. Looking to go here, pawn takes. Grab this pawn. Takes, takes. Doesn't take interesting times. Let's grab. Let's hit. It's taken the pawn. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's take. Let's hit the king. This knight wants to jump here to try and get this pawn, but can't do that just yet. Oh, I thought I'd have come down for the knight. Um, knight could go for the pawn, but the pawn's just going to jump down, so I think I need to elevate my king. What's that pawn think it's doing? Interesting times. Right, okay, let's get the king across. See if we can get this knight for free. It's going to have to try and disrupt these pawns now with his pawns while our king comes across. So let's get the king across, trying to get this knight for free. So let's hit this pawn. I don't know if we can though, you know. Well, yeah we can, because if we come down here, he has to do something. Knight can take it if he goes there, pawn can take it if he goes there, king can take it if he goes here. Yes, excellent. Let's grab. Let's come for this pawn. Let's go for ease of movement. Oh, nice one. Excellent. So that's an inch that was an interesting game. Okay, so this is the unfiltered practice warm-up session type thing, the type of thing that I do um, before I go in and then do some you know proper recordings as best possible. Not to say we win or lose or draw any of them all the time, but it's good practice.